absolutely, without a doubt, one of the reasons why I enjoy sharing conversations with a lot of creative people is because there's always a story. There's always something that never reaches the reader, the viewer, or even the listener. And so it's become my goal to try to get to that story. Don't pressurize it, but just get to it by way of communicating in the way that we're all communicators. Just share a story, share a conversation, build up the intensity by getting to that point, that point where they say, blah, blah, blah. Hey, it's Arrow. This is The Choice. This is what I was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day. And I had one of those blah, blah, blah moments. Not a negative. This was one of those moments where you knew when you were receiving it, that it was something that was going to change other people around you. But I got to spend some time yesterday with Brigadier General A.J. Tata. Oh, what a conversation. Sure, we talked about his brand new book and his amazing passion to write stories and how long it's been with him. But he wrapped things up with a huge heartfelt message. This is what he said. We have to stop judging each other for our shortfalls and celebrate the victories, the great things. But we don't. We continue to pick away at the things that didn't go right. Can I say that again? Because I want you to really listen to that. We have to stop judging each other for our shortfalls and celebrate the victories. The great things. But we don't. We continue to pick away at the things that didn't go right. I took his words to heart. It was time to truly look into the positive more than the negative. In fact, I spent the rest of yesterday moving through some unexpected storms. And I got to tell you, my wife joined me on this journey to locate the positive and not the negative. The calling was to see where things went right. And it worked. No matter how many storms we bumped into yesterday, physically and mentally, we were still setting out to find the positive. And it was not easy, but it truly added a different feeling and texture to what we were going through and how it was being played out. So I guess the challenge today would be set aside your instant need to walk with what's negative and begin a path to look for the positive. Shine the light on its course of energy. I'm Arrow, and that's what I was writing while the sun was waking up on a brilliant new day.